There you go. <laughs> it's Roxy. I'm here to do a love reading for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Now, Leo, not every reading going to resonate. You got a jumper. Not every reading. <laughs> How rude they interrupt me. Not every reading can resonate with every Leo out there. So just take what resonates and leave the rest, okay? Now, well, Leo, if you're interested in a personal reading, all my information can be found down in the description box below. I hope you guys are having a great month. My mom, the best woman I ever know. Known. <laughs> I can't talk tonight, excuse me. The best woman I've ever known is a Leo son. Now, let's see. I'm going to go card by card, Leo, and tell you what I see here, okay? So, your gut wish fulfillment without maybe a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. It doesn't have to be a water sign. It can be any sign. But you really, really love this person. And they really, really love you. Or so you thought. <laughs> you really love them. Why I said, and so you thought, is because they might have had a Knight of Wands energy with you. You know, they. this is Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, right? Or you could have had the Knight of Wands. I read the Knight of Wands as the hoe <laughs> of the Zodiac. You might have used somebody for a booty call. Or maybe they used you for a booty call. Yeah, and it's leaving you feeling left out in the cold. Five of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Or they're feeling left out in the cold. Right? It's like, you know, friends with benefits kind of thing. Situation. And somebody might have fallen for the other person. Right? They might have fallen in love. It probably started out as like a friends with benefit or booty call. But somebody feels left out in the cold now. Because the other person might have um, stopped talking to them. Yeah, what you really want with this person is you want everything with them. Taurus, Virgo, Cap. This is Ten of Pentacles. right? Or they want that with you. They might want that with you. They want everything with you. And you maybe you're not reciprocating. Okay? Hmm. A major Arcana is here. A couple of Major Arcanas. The Hermit. You could have gone into Hermit mode. This is Major Arcana. This is a sign of Virgo. All right, you might be dealing with a Virgo, but this is isolation and introspection. This is thinking. You're in your head thinking about a situation, about what this person, or they're doing this to you, okay? Hmm. A lot of major arcana here. Chariot, you want to move forward with this person, or this person wants to move forward. Do you, if somebody, I think somebody, well, what I'm seeing here, somebody is not giving in. <laughs> It's like, you may want to move forward and they don't, or they want to move forward and you don't, right? It could be vice versa, you know what I'm saying? This is a general, so. Yeah, and you think of this person as your happiness. Again, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, right? They're very happy with you also, right? It could be duality. You could both feel the same way about each other. Huh, interesting. You could be dealing with a Scorpio. This is a tower, major arcana again. You have a lot of major arcanas here, Leo. This is interesting. This is... Somebody or somebody that was cleared out of your life that no longer served you. So maybe a Leo a Leo was or a Scorpio was cleared out of your life. A Scorpio probably. If not, somebody was cleared out of your life because they had to go. Okay? Or the person you're dealing with, somebody was cleared out, cleared out of their life so they could be with you, Leo. Interesting. King of Pentacles, right? You may be dealing with an earth sign, but this person is very stable, very loyal, very good with finances, very ambitious. And, or it's you're taking on this energy, right? Also, you could be taking on the energy of the King of Pentacles, but you're definitely a loyal sign, Leo. You're one of the most loyal signs. Next to Pisces. I mean, me. <laughs> Did I say that out loud? And you have the, the Queen of Cups. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio again. So you're very loving to this person. You love them wholeheartedly. Or they love you wholeheartedly. Right? Interesting. You have to make a decision about them. What you're going to do about them. Alright. 
and if you want to re-offer your love to back to them, right? Because you definitely love this person. There's a lot of emotion here, Leo. Yeah, definitely. And here's Ace of Cups. You definitely want to give this person your love again. If you walked away or they walked away, you definitely want to offer them your affection. Hmm. Hopefully they'll take it, right, Leo? Leo, thank you so much for watching this video. I'm sending you love, peace, blessings, and kisses. Mwah! Please stay safe out there. Please take care. And I hope to see you next time. Bye, Leo.